Hey guys, get ready to burst your bust out your lightning cables. The iOS 6 jailbreak is here. Um, now I just I just downloaded um, Evasion. It's the new jailbreak um, utility for iOS 6 to iOS 6.1. It's around 10:30 IST over here. They just released it. Um, this is how you jailbreak it. Basically, you just connect your iPod to your computer, and then you're gonna have to open up the utility. We, I'll have the link to it in the description below. So just go to the software and click the jailbreak button. Now this is what it says. Uh, I'm, I'm not going to cut this video. This is going to be unedited whatsoever. It's going to be unedited. Let's see what's happening on my iPod Touch here. I'm demonstrating this on, iPhone, on an iPod Touch 5th generation. Um, nothing's happening quite yet. But the loading bar seems to be progressing on my computer. Okay, um, I just got a sound of the USB cable disconnecting. It's waiting for my device to reboot. As you can see, it is rebooting. It says, do not touch your device, and I'm not going to do that. Um, Evasion is a product by the group Evaders, as you can see right here. They've been working really hard to get this done. Okay, my iPod Touch is rebooted, although it doesn't say that on the software utility. It says injecting stage 2 of jailbreak data, step monitor 3, and it says I shouldn't touch my device. I had restored my iPod uh, just before this video, so it should take less time than usual. Okay, it says uploading Cydia, it's pretty fast. Uploading Cydia packages. Nothing's happening that much. Right now it says to continue. Please unlock your device and tap the new jailbreak icon. Only tap it once. The screen will go black and then return to the home screen. Okay, so we're gonna have to slide to unlock it. And we're gonna have to click the new jailbreak icon. As you can see right here, it has the Evaders logo on it. Let's gonna click that right there. All right, now it says remounting will start now and it says injecting remount payload. I'm not, I'm not doing anything. My iPod Touch, I'm leaving it alone. Now it says root system successfully mounted. Injecting final jailbreak data. And it says jailbreak complete. The device may restart as it completes this process. Now, as you can see, my iPod Touch really is restarting. Okay, I just got an unconnected, you know, sound from my computer. I'll just wait for my iPod Touch to reboot. Okay, now it says it's uh, the latest logo just popped up, and it says we're starting, and my iPod Touch is starting up again. Okay, the latest logo is back, and it says initializing offsets. Finding offsets, cleaning up. I've been waiting a long time for this jailbreak. And it says, done, continuing the boot. As the previous absence jailbreak uh, quoted, the jailbreak is so easy, your grandma can do it. Um, let me just slide to a lock over here. Now, we have Cydia successfully on my iPod Touch. Let me just go ahead and unplug it. Now that we have Cydia, but my Wi-Fi seems to have gotten disconnected. Let me disconnect that over there. All right, I'm going to type in the password for a second.
Alrighty. Now I should be getting a Wi-Fi signal in a minute. Okay, I got successfully connected to Wi-Fi. Let's go ahead and open up Cydia. And a familiar preparing file system screen shows up. I've actually read a couple of days ago that um, the creator of Cydia, Jay Freeman, had you know updated Cydia so that this wouldn't take as long, although it does seem to be taking fairly long. And my iPod is rebooting. I'm not sure that's supposed to happen. All right, I got Cydia. Um, I am a user. So, and hopefully this will work. There you go, Cydia running on my iPod Touch fifth generation. Let me just prove now so that it's successfully jailbroken. Let me just go ahead and prove to you guys that I am actually running on 6.1 right after Cydia reloads my data. Well, let's go back to the settings app. Okay, so I am on iOS 6.1. I've just restored my iPod and it is successfully jailbroken. Thank you guys for watching.